hi guys welcome back to the channel so today we have another nice delicious nutritious baby food that we're going to be making uh it's like the entire house has flu and my baby also picked flu so we are going to be making mokene or silver fish with irish uh so we begin by roasting the silver fish because we want we want it to be nice yeah we want it to be nice we don't want to just put it in water direct so guys as you see on how i make it i just uh i just got flu i think a few days ago and like last night my i just felt like i just had my baby sneezing she was feeling so bad uh normally whenever i have flu i normally prepare some soup soup soups so she has taken time without eating mokin i think she has eaten mokin like four times uh or silver fish those ones who don't understand mokin the kenyans call it omena uh so this is a nutritious uh nutritious and healthy meal as like let me make it so that i can also have maybe i also have part of it uh so yeah so that you can maybe take the soup of it as thinking of making it like just putting it in water and boiling it but i remembered as like what if she doesn't eat it because she doesn't have appetite at all there's no appetite i was like let me try spice it up and see if she will eat it normally why you normally see me putting matoke in my baby's food because matoke softens the irish there is that thing that my baby doesn't like eating about irish like that about the taste about the texture i don't know but maybe let me call it the texture so every time i put matoke it is like it's like the food slides okay like i don't i don't do it every time but every time i'm making irish potatoes i make sure that i add either matoke or um, carrots or a sweet potato yeah to just help it soft like it becomes more softer but if i'm doing it mash then i just add in milk and then we are good to go that one she enjoys it because it is soft with milk so guys in case you haven't subscribed to the channel do consider subscribing to the channel i'm here with Annalise. she's here helping me she just loves helping she loves also cooking so guys we're going to see how we're going to enjoy this meal and i just told me when we we're making making the food she said first she's not going to eat she doesn't eat silver fish as like cow so i was like okay since she's also here let me try to spice up this silver fish lunch and see if all of them are going to have fun they're going to enjoy it guys do not forget to subscribe to this channel you guys you should know that silver fish is healthy for your child it boosts the immunity yeah if your child is fond of sick 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 and mostly if your baby ever gets measles get the silver fish don't put don't fry it don't put in anything boil it maybe if your baby is one year and a half add in some little salt and then give your baby that soup to take it it will help them a lot it is good to just add it in the diet of your child once in a while at least once a week let them have that silver fish uh, so Annalise Bambi has finished helping me now here we come I have some uh, some coconut oil I made recently mainly to put in my baby's meal maybe I should do a video about it this is coconut oil it is a hundred percent pure organic yeah so it is what i'm using just in case you're wondering and i've added in just little just little like a teaspoon maybe yeah a teaspoon is enough and yeah that is it and i just decided asked if she could help and i was like Kawa. but since we're using the charcoal stove and it was not so hot i was like it's okay we will manage her here yeah i'm sure she won't like get burnt or kind of yeah and then here we have a we have a royco tube normally when i want the food a little tasty we add in analyze has added in the local tube as you can see um because i'm not going to eat, to add in salt yeah but it is the meal we are all going to eat me analyze and and the baby and so yeah so we've added in all our food and behold our mokene our silver fish is here and then lastly we're going to add in water yeah I'm going to add in water and allow the food to cook guys don't forget to subscribe to the channel let's grow let's grow let's grow let your girl go to 1k subscribers i'm so passionate about cooking for for children and so i feel like this is the content i'm bringing on the table like guys here is our meal you people 
the food that I we prepared saying I mean, I'm not going to eat this one me I'm, I mean, I don't want as I talk you're going to see what is going to happen Zia yesterday she didn't eat well it's like Bambi she she do not eat but this food she you see this see what she has we also added some avocado and Bambi my child she ate the food one of the things that relieves a parent is when your child is not feeling well and your baby finds appetite you guys it relieves every parent and then your baby takes some good rest wow you're like wow so we also enjoyed it and Alice is also there eating she's telling me how the food is so yummy and you guys the food is so yummy so yummy you can also if you're on diet you can also diet with your baby Always cook food with your the same food your baby is eating. Eat on the same food. Trust me, you're going to see a big change. You're going to see a very, very, very big change. So, guys, this is it. Please do not forget to subscribe to the channel. We are growing. So, guys, let me show you how our plates came out. This is mine. This is Zia's plate. And, guys, this is Annalise's plate. The one who did not want to eat food. So, that's how we are doing. <laughs> for brenda's plate i don't know where it is but we all did a good job you can just imagine we just scattered everything so that is it you can just imagine zia ate food later she took her her bottle of milk and then right now as i talk she's just playing waiting like in uh, 10 minutes she'll be going to sleep i'm so glad at least now i can also go and rest since i also have flu um just healing but at least this is a meal i can i recommend i recommend bambi parents prepare this for your babies and you come back and thank me just do it that simple as simple as that so you can imagine from this hmm? look at how this wasn't this really heavy for for my eight eight nine months and to this i'm grateful guys have a lovely day i pray for every child who's not having appetite that god gives you appetite this is a nutritious and a healthy meal for your babies have a lovely time do not forget to subscribe to the channel bye see you tomorrow